Loretta King with Dominion Lending Centers again here to talk about fixed versus variable rates. Now, a fixed rate mortgage means that the rate of the mortgage at the time you sign the paperwork, so let's say it's 3.09, you are guaranteed that rate for the entire length of the term, whether it's three years, five years, you are guaranteed that rate. Now, a variable rate mortgage um, is a little bit different. When you sign the paperwork, you're signing to a rate that is prime minus or prime plus basis points. So, for instance, um, prime is 3%. You could be signing a variable rate mortgage for prime plus 0.5. So then your mortgage interest rate would be 3.5% as long as prime stayed at 3%. So if prime drops, your rate drops. If prime goes up, your rate goes up. Um, the benefit to variable is usually that the rates are lower than fixed. At this stage of the game, because our prime rate is so low, there isn't as much advantage to have a variable rate. Um, and there is some risk with variable because it can fluctuate. Uh, most lenders allow you a lock-in point so that if variable, if, if your variable rate starts to rise with prime and it rises to a degree that you're uncomfortable, you can lock in. Every lender is different in terms of, of what rate they're going to allow you to lock in at. Um, that's something to give me a call about and that we can look at your individual options and what's comfortable for you. So that is fixed versus variable. Have a great day.